And now to this week's West 2 Community Champion. And this is someone we're honoring just in time for the holidays and for such a good reason. He works year round to help the Village's Woodworkers Club create toys for children who would otherwise get nothing for Christmas. Sanaka Dange is introducing us to Conway Williams. Santa's workshop's got nothing on these guys. On the busy shop floor of the Villagers Woodworkers Club, or VWC, magic is being made every day. We actually make about 65 different toys that we donate, another two dozen puzzles, and then we make some specialty toys. It's one of the busiest times of the year as they work to get ready for the Christmas holiday. The group created 23 years ago when some villagers set a goal to make 50 wooden toys, cutting out pieces in one garage, sanding them in another, and assembling them. But as requests started pouring in, the group ended up making more than 140 gifts that year. And since then, the group has grown rapidly, with almost 9,300 toys valued at more than $76,000 already shipped this holiday season. And at the heart of the organization are the men and women who pour love into every project. I'm in here over 200 days a year, so it's like a full-time job. It has a lot of impact. I mean, we get a lot of interest, a lot of, a lot of people very happy. It presents the, uh, it helps the uh, villages. I mean, we're the, you know, villages wood shop and we're a nonprofit and this is, this lends it right, right into it. Quiet, but very detailed and very, uh, you know, hard working. Us teaching the, the new people. Conway Williams has been a part of the organization almost since its inception, becoming head of the toy department eight years ago. It's very rewarding and because a lot of these children live in uh, dire circumstances and so forth, they don't have access to perhaps electronics and the toys that we make are imagination driven, no batteries, nothing like that. So it, it helps the children grow and mature and learn to do things on their own. The toys made here support children in Sumter Lake in Marion counties through schools, churches and charitable organizations like the Children's Home Society of Florida, Operation Shoebox and Sozo Kids. More than 120,000 toys have been donated since the start of the program. This is a team of people who are very dedicated to the idea that the children are important in our future so that we're trying to do what we can to help them mature. The cause is near and dear to Conway's heart, who has this wish for kids this year. I hope that the toys that we donate to them uh, give them some joy in their life and that they have something that they can call their own. So it's very important to give them that feeling. A West 2 community champion dedicated to the true meaning of the holidays. In the villages, Sonica Dange, West 2 News. Mm, what a wonderful story, and I'm yeah. sure that feeling will be, I'm sure those kids will have that feeling absolutely of joy and something of their own. Well, do you know someone with a history of doing good here in Central Florida? West 2 wants to know about them. Nominate those with a track record of giving back for West 2 Community Champion Spotlight. Email us the details about your nominee to communitychampion at west.com. They could be featured right here on West 2 on Thursdays.